graphic card is a component which handles the signals that are sent to the monitor or graphics. It is responsible for generating all the text and pictures on your screen. It's called a graphics card because it can be inserted in a PCI slot on the motherboard. 2D or 2 dimensional graphics are the kind of graphics displayed when you use a web browser, check email or work on a spreadsheet. For 2D graphics, the major factors are resolution and refresh rate. Resolution determines how many little dots are used to draw the image on the screen, which are also called as pixels. For example, 640 into 480 means that the whole screen is drawn using 307,200 little dots in 640 columns and 480 rows. The more dots that are used, the finer the detail. And refresh rate refers to how many times a second the image on the screen is redrawn. 60 hertz means that the image on the screen is drawn 60 times every second. This becomes important in a fast moving video game where the action needs to look real. 3D or 3 dimensional graphics are used mostly by first person shooter type of games. Of course, current monitor technology still only really displays a 2D image, but the player is immersed in a landscape where they can move their character's head and see objects in all directions and move around within this world. This type of display capabilities requires some pretty intense mathematical calculations to be done very fast. The value of a good 3D graphics card is that it offloads most of this work from computer's main processor and a specialized processor on the graphic card handles these calculations. This allows for faster, slicker looking graphics. Also, newer 3D cards handles all kinds of additional functions that give surface texture, makes water transparent, etc. So basically, a graphic card will handle all the display work and keep the processor free to perform other lightweight jobs.